Hi everyone, this is Claudia from Remax Center. I'm here today with Chris Castellano from Camera Spell Corp Inc. talking about our new project in Mississauga called EXS. Claudia, thank you so much for being here. Thank you, Chris. Let's jump into it. Let's talk a little bit about EXS and we'll talk uh, about some stuff that your clients are interested in learning. Um, so EXS is our final chapter of the Exchange District. Okay. So, you know, you and the team have been so successful helping us move our previous projects, EX1, EX2, EX3. So we're very excited to have you and the team join us Thank for you, EXS. I think, you know, what really helps differentiate EXS from the other buildings in this development is that it's a very much a boutique building compared to the other ones. So it's only 31 stories and it's going to have the boutique hotel in it as well. So that's further going to condense the availability in this building. And more important than all that, it's the last opportunity to get into this award-winning exchange right. district master plan community. Right. So the district itself, right? Award-winning this year, we won master plan community of the year at the nationals down in Florida. So huge, you know, huge adulations for the community. And it's just nice to see a project in Canada and Mississauga get the recognition that I think we we deserve. Right. Um, over the years, what we've done with this community is to really design it and build it as an urban international community. So not only are you getting four incredible towers, the last of which is EXS, which we'll talk about, right. but you're getting incredible pedestrian space with the pedestrian piazza designed by BDP Architects. You're getting incredible restaurants. Like we talked about last time, we were right. for the last launch, Biblos is coming, Edo Sushi is coming, Zaza Coffee is coming. Um, and not only are you getting incredible retail and grocery store, but you're getting this boutique hotel and this boutique building that we're coming out to the market with. So really what's setting EXS a level above the other buildings is not only its service offering that'll be available because of the hotel, but also the luxurious finishes that we're putting in. Okay. So I know your viewers can't see this right now, but we're actually sitting in our sales office. It's right. a bit under construction, <laughs> gonna be finished shortly, but you know, being one of our Platinums, you get a sneak peek, Thank but we're you. gonna be putting in uh, Mila appliances, so very high-end European right. appliances. We've got Trevisana coming to do the kitchens. So, uh, you know, kitchens imported from Italy, assembled here on site. Um, and we're working with Kohler to do all of our plumbing fixtures. Mm -hmm. So very high end finishes right. that you can see that are going in right. the building. And then with the service level we're bringing, because of the hotel in it, we're gonna be extending the hotel services, if they so choose, to the residences, the residents. So they can opt into things like housekeeping services, turn down services, room service, uh, personalized lifestyle management through the concierge, dog walking, indoor landscaping, front of the line ticket access, really anything you can think of and anything you see in high-end hotel residences in downtown Toronto, in New York, in Tokyo, uh, in Europe, we're gonna be bringing to EXS and Exchange District. Mm -hmm. So that's really you know, what sets EXS apart at this point is not only is it the last opportunity to buy into Exchange District, but it also is bringing a level of service and level finish that Mississauga just doesn't have right now. So is this what you would say why you would stand out amongst your competitors in the market today? I think so. I think when you look at the landscape of Mississauga right. today, you've got a good amount of developments that take a more suburban approach, a more traditionally okay. Mississaugan uh, suburban approach to development. We really want it to be a true urban development. That's why we put so much emphasis on the pedestrian realm of our development. So I think that's one of the things that helps set our development apart. And then for EXS itself, you know, when you take the time to look at the overall real estate market in Mississauga, you notice that it's lacking that high-end, high-service right. um, condominium, right. which is what we're addressing with EXS. When you look at downtown Toronto, you see a dozen of buildings that Absolutely. do this, right? When you look at New York, you see dozens of buildings. Right. When you look London, et cetera, all other international places, you see a service offering like this or a product offering like this. So now we're gonna be bringing it to Mississauga. And I think that's really what's gonna help set EXS apart from the other product in the market today. Okay. 
So in regards to comparing Mississauga to different cities, yes. a lot of investors are like, why Mississauga? Why why not a different city? For sure. Why would, they, why would you say they should invest into Mississauga, especially your product than any other city out there? Yes. So Mississauga, for whatever reason, has always been viewed as a suburb of Toronto. Right. When in actuality, it's a true city unto itself. When you look at you know, Statistics Canada, you see that the household income in Mississauga isn't that far off from Toronto, like what we would consider downtown Toronto, right? right? Couple of thousand dollars. Um, when you look at the job market in Mississauga, you see an extraordinarily robust market offering here. Currently, you've got over 40,000 businesses. You've got the head offices of over 70 Fortune 500 companies. You've got Pearson Airport. Um, you've got Sheridan College, which is quite literally right across the road from Exchange District and EXS. You've got Square One Shopping Center, the second largest shopping center in Canada, right across the road from EXS. You've got University of Toronto's Mississauga campus, just a short commute away. So you see that Mississauga has all the requirements to be a world-class location and truly is a world-class location. So when you're comparing Mississauga to other cities, either be it in Canada right. or around the world, you see that Mississauga brings all the necessary, um, ticks off all the necessary boxes to be a sound place to both purchase or invest. Going into it a bit further, when you look at the statistics of when we launched our first project EX1 here in Exchange District yeah. to where we stand today with EXS, you can see that there's been um, a compression of the gap between pricing and um, between pricing with t downtown Toronto and rental rates. So when we first started this journey back in 2018, 2019 yeah. with EX1, you know, you had a strong double digit gap in rental rates between downtown Toronto and downtown Mississauga. Now, as of Treb's latest numbers, you see that gap actually being compressed to almost 1.8 percent, right? Correct. Almost kiff kiff between Mississauga yeah. and downtown Toronto, but you still have a pretty healthy gap in price point discrepancy. And you know, when you look at that, when you look at the fact that Mississauga real estate has been on a huge rise over the past couple of years, and at times has even outpaced Toronto real estate in terms of value gained, um, value gained on a resale price as well as a rental price. You see that all the signs are there pointing to Mississauga being a worthwhile investment hub for real estate. So you're saying there's a lot of gap to cover in between, so we still have a lot more to go to. I think so, you know, because the big question is what sort of runway do we have? Right. And I think that that question can't be answered simply by looking at numbers, but by also considering what the product offering Correct. is. So when you start looking at a place like Exchange, like EXS, that offers more than just some condo, right? We offer a boutique building with a boutique hotel, with a high level of service. We're offering 20,000 square feet of amenities in an award-winning master plan community. You start getting all these little intangibles that will help propel value into the future. If you look at comparable buildings in downtown Toronto or in other cities in Canada, you see that those buildings always trade at a premium to all the other options because there just doesn't exist a lot of stock like this at right. the end of the day, right? There isn't a huge supply of high-end service buildings Correct. like this. There isn't a huge supply of boutique buildings like this. So I think when you talk about runway or gaps, it's important to compare the Mississauga real estate market to the Toronto real estate market, but it's also important to understand the product offering that's coming out. So, you know, this will always trade at a premium to everything else because of the amenities you're getting, the services you're getting, and the lifestyle residents will be able to live in this building versus other buildings in and around the area. Good. Well, I know EX1, 2, 3 were yes. a very good Huge and success successes. Exactly. Yes. And I'm very confident that EXS will be nothing but better than those. So that that's the plan. Listen, you know, with EX one, two, three, we were able to fairly rapidly sell through 1,500 units. Absolutely. Um, which goes to show the market believes in this location and this mar the market believes in this product offering. So now for this last building, we're offering such a limited opportunity to get into a very high service, high luxury building. So 
we're very excited to see where this yeah. goes in the future. We're actually very excited as well. All our clients, investors, we're all looking forward to this. And Amazing. I can't wait to work with you on this project Amazing. again. Amazing. Looking forward to it, Claudia. Well, thank you, Chris. Thank you so much.